Hi everyone, I am Shushang Bhandari. Welcome to our channel. I am a maths faculty at Concepts from last 10 years. I worked 100 on 100 in this subject when I was in 12th. I liked maths and I love maths because this is the scoring subject and I believe if you are calculation and if you love doing calculation then this is the easiest subject in which you can also score 100 on 100. Now here are some important hacks which I would like to share with you. Hack number one, follow the order of the chapters as laid down in NCRT book. Hack number two, next you should start with algebra which will cover 13 marks including matrices and determinants. This is the easiest topic and scoring topic also. You have to be careful with your calculation and practicing only one topic of each type will be more than enough. Hack number three which covers relation function and inverse trigger which carries around 10 marks into paper. This, these questions will be slightly difficult but can be made easier if you read it two or three times. Hack number four. So in order to analyze your performance, you should spend one minute on one marker, for four marker at least 10 minutes, for six marker at least 15 minutes. This will include a total of two and a half hours. After completing your two and a half hours of paper, you have ample of time, 30 minutes to revise your paper once again. Hack number five. Vectors in 3D which covers around 17 marks. Questions are easy directly from NCRT book. So if you practice, if you stick only to NCRT, this will cover your 17 marks. Hack number 6. This covers probability and linear programming which is for 16 marks. Questions will be easy if you read it again and again and before answering it on an answer sheet, make a rough column, make small small point for it and then finally write it down on your answer sheet. Act number 7, this is calculus which includes half of the paper marks, around 44 marks. This is the main scoring topic. Mainly before doing this, these topics, you should be thorough with your formulas, make a list of all the formulas make a chart paper for it, stick it on board and make sure that you should look it on a daily basis 3 to 4 times. Hack number 8. So maths is all about practicing. So please ensure that you do one sample paper every day. If you try these hacks, I'm sure you will get good amazing marks. From last past 10 years of experience, I've made these hacks and I believe if even if you also follow this, my students are following this, I followed it, I got good marks, I got 100 on 100. So if you also follow, I'm sure you will also get good marks. Best of luck, like and subscribe for more videos.